So what we do, I become so busy during the day so that when it gets at night, I'm tired. And when I get to bed, when it, I'm supposed to sleep on my left by the way. So that when I start sleeping on my left, immediately, you see this in Anishika, then at, maybe in the middle of the night, come and make choker. I'm not supposed to sleep on my bank, so I told Brian, just keep an eye at night, maybe umejoko usingizi mtu aisijua sio so nikinena kwa mgongo you can maybe wake me up at night and I'm be oh baby you start to look at my time and you're right it's been a struggle but it's a blessing on the way so we just thank God <laughs> uh, I called our gynecologist and he told me I'm supposed to sleep on I mean I can sleep on my sides but more especially on the left because the baby breathes from the left side so when I sleep on the left side it's a bit comfortable and it's blood circulation and also oxygen for me and the baby is good so I'm not supposed to sleep on my back because there's a vena cava which if you sleep on it there'll be less oxygen it causes problems so what we do I'm supposed to sleep on my left and not back or right oh. you understand yeah. yeah so that's the problem on my left. It's not easy because a seven month old baby stomach is huge, see. So all this weight coming to my left and sometimes I try to put pillow in between and it's not even comfortable. You find that you sleep for one hour I love in a quad so much. Ah, it's just tiresome. Sleeping struggles. There's also <laughs> tying the shoes. Bending. <laughs> Bending is a problem. Sometimes I think my mind just you you forget you're pregnant, so you just bend at a point. Oh, I'm pregnant. Because there's a certain feeling just up by abdomen. I 
I don't know if it's pain or I don't know, but discomfort. It's eh? very discomfort. Yeah, it's not comfortable. It's very uncomfortable. Yeah, so when you want to bend, there's a certain way you're supposed to bend. Like you open your legs right there, you go down. <laughs> or, um, Brand has been really good help to me. I mean, the whole pregnancy goes. Sometimes when I'm unable to wear my socks, Brian and his idea. When I'm unable to tie my shoes, Brian and his idea. He basically does like 90% of my stuff. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm fat because uh, you know I'm used to my size 28 waist and hips 54. 54, yeah. <laughs> So when I put on my dress, you just feel the, a, a nice hourglass figure, you know. But, but right now, mm -hmm. when I put on my, in fact, I can't fit in my normal clothes. So like I jeans, to, okay. No, I don't wear jeans. I only put on dresses and sometimes pants. And the dresses I have, the old new. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. So, I'm a size 16, but I went for shopping. Right now, I'm putting on size 18. I've added like 6 kgs. But the, the, the funny thing is, is any, any, the way you feel mm. is so funny because your spouse feels you know, the same way. Yeah, like the jeans is oh. <laughs> Yeah, by the way, it's true. You're also pregnant, right? Mm, no, I'm pregnant anyway, really. Yeah. But you don't have a baby. Yeah, because so, your clothes are not fitting you, some of them. Mm, I, I, also, feel, uh, I feel fat and fabulous, Pia. <laughs> <laughs> Until you feel fat and fabulous. Yeah, fat and fabulous. Yeah, but it's something, it's just a mindset. I'm not going to be like this for the rest of my life, right? Mm, yeah, it's just so. for a short period of time, nine mm. months, and then I'll get back to my normal, normal body. Yeah. And you promise you're going to pay for my surgery? For no, you don't. You, you don't but need the surgery. Me. No, no, no. What is the deal? No, it, it's like this, and if, for me, I think you're okay. You know, the way you are, you you give back to a, a healthy baby, mm. and then you go back to to, to say many the first nine months. And you now you breastfeed because you cannot be starving yourself, you know. So you, so you, you breastfeed, so you, you breastfeed, and then you know, after to see many people actually manage that. You know, you start doing you know, jumping, jumping. You're going to the gym. Yeah, then you lose in the right way. Easy story is a shortcut, and you have to cut and you know, it's too much, you know. But what did you mean when you told me that we'll have a surgery? No, you could say that you have a surgery mm. unless you need it, but if not, then there is no point. But I'm sure you bounce about it. You can use enough career. Oh, at least you don't want to name it, you look funny. No, mm. I'm sure you look nice because okay. I trust you can check you. your mom. Yeah, my mom is, yeah, has a flat tummy mom, and she has five exactly, kids. Exactly, so yeah. I think we're talking about it. Thank you, I so trust you. Yeah, yeah. 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 There's another thing. So I've been having weird cravings, a lot of cravings, but I have a good support system because at home we have uh, things like yogurt, me and all that healthy stuff yeah eh? healthy stuff so when i'm craving savory like let's say for example crisps biscuits these are sugary things he takes out one of the yogurt the majority of yogurt that the lemon squeeze is going to flavor it's going to biscuits it's biscuit, going yeah. to chicken flavor <laughs> but chicken flavor so when i want biscuits he'll give me yogurt which has biscuit mm. which is a Healthy alternative, yeah. Rather uh, than is my my just yeah. scary scary mm. you know, the I don't chips want to gain so much weight. Mm. when I have the baby, it will be hard for me to lose, you know. I'm talking to you, Kabisa. So no, no, my mind is not pregnant. I know I'm packing my point up for Kuba. Hmm. I love the videos. I know our lips. For me, I thank God. Videos na kuwa na kama kama sausage. The only part of my body in an abdomen is stomach. Actually. That's good. Imagine that I mean, you know, I and see it's that. Not that big. No, it's not big. It's not big. Yeah. It's good size and it's normal size. Mm -hmm. And there's no. Uh, uh -huh. Watch that coolie bus. Mm. 
Bon appétit, chérie. Thank you. Ah, masala is sweet. Mm. 